And this is the super duper, super treasure hunt chase car that everybody was looking for all of 2018. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Hot Wheels TV. Today we have all 15, 5, 10, 15, of the 2018 Hot Wheels Super Treasure Hunts. And we're going to take a look at each and every one of them for you right now. Number one up from the A case is the Datsun 620 pickup truck. And that is done in a... Uh, Spectra Flame Olive has a dark blue plastic base on it. Now remember, a lot of the cars that came through this year, uh, the bases that look like they were black plastic are actually a super, super dark blue if you look at them under the right light. So this one has a dark blue plastic base on it. The wheels are a blacked out rocket wheels, all small all the way around, and of course with rubber tires. The interior and the bed liner in the back are uh, dark gray plastic. Windows are smoked pretty dark. Tampos on it are uh, a cream and black and this is a, uh, a cool looking little ride. It's got uh, green camo on the, on the hood and uh, a whole bunch of sponsored decals along the side. Pretty cool. Second one up out of the B case is the 68 Chevy Nova. Now you're gonna say, Mike, how do you know uh, which one is which? Right up here on the back of the card is the case number. The US release uh, packages have the last letter up here is the case number. Last one was the A case, this is the B case, and the rest goes all the way down the line. So the 68 Chevy Nova, it comes in a nice uh, Spectra Flame purple, has a chrome plastic base on it. Um, now the wheels on this are gray. Now I saw this in, uh, in Walmart one time and I didn't pay attention to the wheels because everybody's always talking about the, the wheels on these things being, you know, chrome and mag wheels and rocket wheels and, you know, all kinds of uh, Ferrari wheels, whatever. Uh, but I didn't expect it to have gray, and this one does, has a yellow ring around it also. And I just blew it off as being the regular uh, 68 Nova when it, uh, when it first came out. So I missed out on it that time, so don't you miss out. Keep an eye out for those wheels. Uh, interior on this is orange, window is clear, and the tampos are uh, yellow, mustard yellow on the hood. And uh, the side's got some flames, and the, uh, the trunk lid has a couple of stripes down there. Out of the C case is the Porsche 934.5. 0.5, I don't know why. Who knows? But, hey, cool looking ride. It is uh, a really nice Spectra Flame blue, a light blue to it. Has a dark blue plastic base on it. The wheels are, um, I don't know what they are. They're, uh, you know, them European cool looking things. They're white plastic. Of course, the rubber tires on all of the Supers. This has a uh, very dark tinted window. And I want to say the interior is, uh, I don't know, man. It looks, it could be dark gray. Very, uh, you can't see. That's how dark this window is. Very, very dark. Uh, headlights are done up, you know, pretty decent. Uh, tampos are on the are white on the side. Says 34 and Porsche with the Treasure Hunt logo on the rear quarter panel. Nice. Out of the D case is the 2015 Ford Mustang GT. It's got the Borla uh, tampos on the, on the side. Has a kind of a dull red striping on the hood. The roof and the trunk lid and of course down the side. Now this car is a very dark charcoal gray. It's not black. Uh, the base on this is uh, actually it's a 
black plastic base, not like the others with a dark blue. Uh, this has all small, uh, I want to say blacked out all the way around with a chrome rim. Interior is uh, dark gray and the windows are dark smoked. Next one up is from the E-Case. That is the Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR. And for some reason, this thing, you know, when you look at it sideways, it looks like a, a Maverick. I don't know why, but it looks like, a, looks like an early Maverick. And uh, this has a dark blue plastic base on it. The wheels are uh, a very dark blue four-spoke, and they have a chrome ring around them. Uh, tampos on the side only, and it is a uh, pearl blue, a light pearl blue. Interior is black, and the windows are dark smoked. The uh, taillights are done up nice on this one, uh, and there's also a, uh, looks like a skyline tampo uh, or a logo uh, close to the taillights on the rear. Next up, out of the F case, is the Indy 500 oval. That is done in a, uh, looks like a, a teal mixed with a lot, a lot of silver in the metallic. That is uh, really neat looking. If you look at the, the picture on the card, the picture on the card shows it blue. So um, it could be, you know, silverish blue. Uh, but I'm looking more like, you know, under the light here, it looks kind of like silverish teal. The base is orange plastic. The wheels are orange plastic four spokes. And uh, tampos on it are, of course, the Golf uh, tampos, which make it look really, really cool. Nice looking car. We have the 68 Mustang, which is from the G case. And that's done in a nice dark Spectra Flame gold. The base is dark blue plastic. The wheels are blacked out black enamel rocket wheels with a red chrome ring on them. The interior is, looks like black, and the windows are very, very dark tinted. Uh, tampos on the side are uh, black, red, and some pearl blue. This is a nice looking car. Got a big monster supercharger and uh, carburetors with velocity stacks hanging out of the hood. Uh, old school, old school street freak. I really, really love this kind of stuff. Nice looking ride. They're all nice looking rides. Come on, man. Who wouldn't want to get into any one of these things and drive it around, right? From the H case. Now, the last one, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Okay. Because there are some that they, that they, that they skip. Um, and we're, we'll, we'll see, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. There is no I, which uh, next one up will be the J, and there is no O. So, uh, and the reasoning for that is, I guess, because uh, you can't tell the I from an L and an O from a zero, so they, uh, they skip those two. Here we have the 2017 Camaro ZL1, and that is done in Spectra Flame Green. The base is dark blue plastic. The wheels are uh, dark gray rocket wheels with a chrome ring on them. Tampos are uh, black on the hood with a silver ZL1. Uh, down the side, also black and silver. Interior is black and the windows are lightly tinted. Next up from the J case is the 52 Chevy. It is pink Spectra Flame and it has a dark blue plastic base. The wheels are all small chrome reverse. The interior, I cannot see what it is because the windows are that dark, but I'm going to guess it's, uh, it's probably, hopefully, black. Uh, the tampos on it are really cool pinstriping white on the hood and the roof, uh, front fender and rear fender, and the side of the door says Hot Wheels. Very nice, uh, nicely done. Very old school looking. Pretty cool. The K case is the Aventador Mura Homage. Homage? Homage? And uh, that is done in a nice dark red spectrum flame. The base is very dark blue plastic. 
The wheels are um, the wheels are a tan plastic, and they look like um, actually Ferrari GT three hundred eight wheels. But um, I don't know if uh, Lamborghini has those kind of wheels. I don't know. But uh, yeah, they look like GT three hundred eight wheels. And the interior is black, and the window is uh, lightly tinted. Tampos on the front. The uh, headlights are done up really nice, and there are no tampos on the back for the taillights. The side has a little bit of gold on it, and uh, and some maybe dark gold or brown on the rocker panel. From the L case is the King Cuda, and this thing is absolutely beautiful. I love this car. I would love to have a real one. Uh, absolutely beautiful car. And it is done in a very dark charcoal metallic. The base is a dark blue, and man, you can really see the blue in the base in this one. Uh, wheels are a dark gray rocket wheel with a chrome rim. Interior is chrome. And the windows are a dark blue transparent. Got a beautiful uh, supercharged Hemi sitting in the engine compartment. And uh, got bug catcher injection on it sitting up there uh, about halfway through the windshield. Nice, nice looking car. Out of the M case is the 2017 Audi RS6. Avant. And that is in a nice dark red Spectre Flame. The base is a very dark gray on this one. Uh, interior is black. The window is lightly tinted. It has um, the double stamp chrome rims on it with uh, wheel rider tires. The front end is really, really nicely detailed. The headlights, the grill, uh, and of course the back also has the license plate and the taillights are done up really, really nice on this car. Um, out, of, out of all of these, um, this one's got some really, really good detail. From the N case is the Fiat 500. And that is in a, um, I want to say butterscotch or a brown or orange. I don't know, it's kind of a, kind of a hard color. You be the judge. The base is uh, dark blue plastic. The wheels are a yellow plastic, all small, all the way around. Um, interior is black plastic. Window is uh, clear. The tampos are on the hood and the roof and the side, and they are black and yellow and white. I don't see any uh, taillights or headlights done up on this one. Next up, from the P case, and a lot of people were going crazy over this car, um, is the 70 Ford Escort RS1600, and that is in a very dark candy apple blue. The base is a pearl orange plastic. The wheels are chrome all the way around, small ones, and uh, the interior is black, and the window is a very dark transparent blue. The colors are done up as the Hot Wheels race team, and of course this is from the Hot Wheels 50th race team series. This was one of the cars that a lot of people were really going crazy looking for. The Cruella de Vil, and that is from the G case, and that is done in a dark red Spectre Flame. The base is a pearl gray plastic, and it has big swoopy black plastic fenders on it. The wheels and tires are chrome reverse with great big white walls on it. Interior is black. Front and back windows are chrome. Has a uh, big white wall painted spare tire on the back and the tail lights are done up also. The grill is beautiful big and chrome and got great big headlights on it. This is a really really nice looking car. Now I want to show you this Da -da -da. Magic, right? This is the Bone Shaker, and this is the super duper super treasure hunt chase car that everybody was looking for all of 2018. It came and it went. This is from the L case. Um, people were paying some super, super big money for this thing, 
And uh, I was thinking that they were going to do a bunch of chase. Uh, probably, I was hoping they would do one uh, for every case code, but they only did this one. And uh, here it is. This is the Bone Shaker, done in a very dark candy apple blue. Base is a pearl orange plastic, just like this one here, the, uh, the Escort. The wheels are a very dark blue chrome rocket wheel. It has a red line tire on it, and the interior is black tint chrome. The engine's black tint chrome. The fuel tank in the back is black tint chrome, and the grill with the, the skull on the front is black tint chrome also. This thing is a beautiful, beautiful car. Even the rear suspension that you can see uh, is black tint chrome. This thing is absolutely gorgeous. Um, the Tampos are the Hot Wheels 50th race team. This is definitely a nice, nice looking car. And there you have it, all 15 of the 2018 Super Treasure Hunt cars plus the Chase Bone Shaker. Now I got all of these cars from the 2018 Master Set. Uh, I keep telling everybody, this is the way to go. Uh, if you're gonna chase all this stuff, not chase, huh? Chase. That's the key. If you're gonna be chasing all of this stuff, um, you know, just think of all the time and effort you put into chasing. You know, I'm, I'm not gonna say don't go hunting, cause, cause I do. I hunt every day. And uh, but if you really, really want one of everything, you know, there's 474, 75 cars, 480 cars. I don't know. There's just there's a lot of cars in that in that master set, and uh, they all come all at once, one big box, and and they're and they're here. And that's a great thing. So that is it. We really appreciate you watching Hot Wheels TV. Please share our videos. Please tell your friends. Please be kind to one another, and uh, please subscribe. So until the next time, we see you right here at Hot Wheels TV. Hopefully, we'll see you someplace else. Take care now. Bye-bye.